In this tutorial, we will learn how to create consistent characters and consistent scenes. Let's dive in. Part 1. Creating consistent characters. Step 1. Writing the character prompt with ChatGPT. First, go to ChatGPT and brainstorm to create a basic prompt describing your character. Include details like age, hair color and type, clothing, and scene, what the character is doing. For example, you might describe a character as a teenager with shoulder-length straight brown hair, wearing glasses and a yellow sweater, sitting at a desk in a quiet library. End the prompt by specifying that this is a consistent character and select a style, such as Pixar style. Step 2. Adding a unique number. At the beginning of the prompt, add seed number, followed by any random 5-digit number. This number will help you track your character, but it doesn't matter which number you choose. Step 3. Naming your character. Give your character a name. It can be anything. Let's call our character Jane for this example. Step 4. Creating different scenes. Now, identify the action in your prompt. For example, if Jane is sitting at a desk in a quiet library in the first prompt, you can change the action for the next scene. In the second prompt, Jane might be walking through the school hallway with a backpack or in another scene, she could be studying with friends at a coffee shop. If you're looking for inspiration, ask ChatGPT to suggest more scenarios for your character. Use a table to plan out different scenarios for your character, only changing the action description while keeping the rest of the prompt the same. Here's an example table showing one consistent character across eight different scenes. The bolded parts are the actions in the prompt, and they are the parts you change. Step 5. Generating images in Canva. Now, copy the first prompt and head over to Canva. Scroll down to the Magic Media app and paste in the first prompt into the text box. You can also choose the style and aspect ratio here. For this example, I'll stick with Pixar movie style. So I'll choose none. Click Generate Image to receive four images. Choose the one that best represents your vision and place it on your canvas. If needed, click Generate More like this to get additional options. Repeat this process for each scenario, ensuring the character remains consistent while the action changes. Part 2. Creating consistent scenes Step 1. Describing and generating the scene. For this method, we will focus more on consistent backgrounds rather than the character. Start by brainstorming a prompt that describes a scene. For example, a cozy city cafe with large windows, wooden tables, and soft lightning, set during a rainy afternoon. Again, specify the style. I'll go again with Pixar movie style for this example. Click Generate Image to create the scene. Pick the option that best fits your project and add it to your design. Step 2. Adding characters or objects to the scene. Now, let's add characters or objects to the background. You can modify the prompt to include, for example, a businessman with a briefcase dressed in a suit, typing on his laptop, and let's generate the image. If it fits the scene, add it to your project. You can also generate characters or objects separately and use Canva's background remover tool to place them into your scene. Let's try this on a simpler background like a calm beach with soft waves gently crashing on the shore, golden sand under a bright blue sky. And Pixar movie style. I'll choose this scene and generate a character to fit in. For example, a young surfer with red surfboard standing at the water's edge, looking out the waves, Pixar movie style. I like this one, so I'll add it to the beach scene and remove its background. Perfect. And that's it for this video, I hope you find it helpful, make sure to subscribe to my channel to learn more Canva tricks and design like a pro.